Guys, I seriously have a poor man's <laughs> or poor woman's photo photography setup right here. So I kind of figured out a DIY way of diffusing my ring light because it was too bright and the background, my new black background, made the light too bright so I googled and I found um, someone said they were giving a lot of ideas like muslin and I don't know what that is and cloth and I was worried about the cloth being flammable so I found someone say baking paper and I was like what oh my gosh I have some parchment paper let me try it so I got some parchment paper I got two big sheets of it and I cut each of them in half and folded it around my ring light, like the actual light itself, not like all around because I was trying to tape it but the waxy texture of it just kept sliding the tape off. But I'm so proud of this and my husband tried to help me do a pillowcase but I was afraid of that being um, flammable also. Um, it's so genius. Parchment paper is supposed to be baked, so it goes up to a certain amount of degrees, and I'll try not to leave it on too long just to be safe. But I'm so excited. You can see my face. I can do makeup tutorials. My skin ain't perfect. It's starting to break out because I've been drinking so much coffee. I'm obsessed. Absolutely obsessed. And I cleaned my camera. <laughs> I have a cold sore coming on. Hopefully it goes away. Whenever I have a cold sore, the hubby and I don't kiss. So we don't spread it. And now I can't kiss my little ones. Um, but hopefully it'll go away. I'm putting on a DIY. I mean not DIY. A cheap and natural um, cold sore healer. It's a lip balm. Uh, I wanted to do a video on it, especially because, okay, my lips, they're pretty, like, full. So, they get really dry, especially when the weather changes. So, like, usually it's hot here. So, if it turns cold one day and then hot the next, I my lips get super dry. My hair freaks out a little bit and my legs get super dry. Okay, well, I hope you ignore the imperfections. I'm not wearing makeup, and this is my natural hair, and I'm just wearing my hubby's um, Superman t-shirt. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think of this new setup. I'm so excited. No one said anything about my setup yet. Um, please tell me something about my setup. <laughs> just tell me if it looks good, if there's anything I can fix. I mean... God made me like this naturally, so I can't fix that. It's so weird because I have a dimple that only comes, like, sometimes. <sighs> a subscriber told me that I, like, switch from one idea to the next to the next, but that's just how I am. Um, I can't help it. I'm so excited to do makeup tutorials. Let me know what kind of makeup tutorials you would like to see. Um, I'm not sure which ones I'm going to do yet. Now I'm tiptoeing. <laughs> Maybe. Well, it's... I have like a poor man's setup. That's what I started with, right? And I totally ran away from what I was saying. Um, but the parchment paper and then my ring light, as much as I love it, I would give it four stars because... It's wobbly, it's not, it doesn't stay perfectly like in place, so I have a mini Bible underneath of it because I have a whole bunch of little Bibles that people give me. I hope that's not horrible, I already apologized, <laughs> but yeah, so I have like a little Bible there. And it's just to, like, so it's not wobbly. And then I have the parchment paper around it. And the parchment paper gives off kind of like a, a off-white yellowish 
color, which is good for my skin because I have warm toned skin, so I was thinking that the yellowish would be good. Um, so yeah, I'm so excited. I think this looks more professional than the sparkly background. As much as I love the sparkly background, I can always switch it up back to it, but this is more professional looking in my opinion. I'm so excited. You can actually see my face. You can actually see my imperfections. You can actually see my crazy curls. Yeah. Okay. Well, you guys know I love you. And I just wanted to play with my new setup. I wanted to ramble. It's late at night. You guys know that I used to always do that. Um, those who have been there with me since the beginning. I used to be a night owl like hardcore. And I would stay up and I would film. And I would do my makeup just to film. <laughs> Those were the days I don't have that choice anymore. Just when my daughter's sleeping. By the way, I gotta feed my daughter. My daughter, my sweet daughter, Aaliyah. This is, everybody has, ooh, I have a zit. <laughs> it's not really a zit though, it's just like a mark. I thought it was a hive, but just a pimple. But anyways. Um, everybody has their good side. This is my good side. I think I do this look in pictures a little too much <laughs> on this side. Can you see my curls? Mm. Well, my curls aren't going to be shiny because it's against the black background. Maybe I can play with the the brightness and contrast and all that and maybe it'll look better. But I'm excited. <laughs> the littlest things seriously make me happy. Yeah. I will see you in the next video. Bye. How do people do it? <laughs> How do people do it? At the end. Bye, y'all. <laughs> Did I, like, close it? I don't know. Okay. Bye. Keep looking on the wrong side of the camera.